I am happy to join with you today in what will go down in history as the greatest demonstration for freedom in the history of our nation. This is Biography. Martin Luther King Jr. was a prominent leader in the American Civil Rights Movement. Born on January 15, 1929, in Atlanta, Georgia, he was the son of Martin Luther King Sr., a Baptist minister, and Alberta Williams King. King grew up in a deeply religious household and excelled in school, entering Morehouse College at the age of 15. After earning a sociology degree from Morehouse, King attended Crozer Theological Seminary in Pennsylvania and later pursued a Ph.D. in Systematic Theology at Boston University. Martin Luther King Jr.'s personal life was deeply intertwined with his commitment to civil rights and social justice. In 1953, he married Coretta Scott, whom he met while studying in Boston. Coretta was an accomplished singer and musician, and together they had four children, Yolanda, Martin III, Dexter, and Bernice. The Kings faced challenges and hardships as a result of Martin Luther King Jr.'s activism. The family often received threats, and their home was bombed in 1956 during the Montgomery bus boycott. Despite these difficulties, Coretta remained a steadfast supporter of her husband's work, and she also became actively involved in the civil rights movement. She played a crucial role in advocating for social justice, participating in protests, and speaking on behalf of the movement. King's leadership in the civil rights movement gained prominence during the Montgomery bus boycott in 1955. This protest, sparked by Rosa Parks' refusal to give up her bus seat to a white person, marked the beginning of King's nonviolent activism. The boycott ultimately led to a Supreme Court ruling desegregating public transportation. In 1957, King helped found the Southern Christian Leadership Conference, SCLC, an organization committed to achieving full civil rights for African Americans through nonviolent protest. King's philosophy of nonviolent resistance was deeply influenced by Mahatma Gandhi's teachings. One of King's most iconic moments was his leadership in the 1963 March on Washington for Jobs and Freedom, where he delivered his famous, I Have a Dream speech. This speech resonated with its powerful call for racial equality and justice. King's commitment to civil rights extended beyond racial issues. He spoke out against the Vietnam War and advocated for economic justice, addressing issues of poverty and inequality. His activism and speeches earned him the Nobel Peace Prize in 1964. I've been to the mountaintop is the last speech delivered by Martin Luther King Jr. He delivered it on April 3, 1968, at the Mason Temple Church of God in Christ headquarters in Memphis, Tennessee. In the speech, King reflects on the various challenges faced by the civil rights movement. He talks about the threats to his life and recounts the numerous difficulties encountered in the struggle for civil rights, including the bombing of his home. One of the most famous aspects of the speech is that I've been to the mountaintop metaphor. King describes how, like Moses, he has seen the promised land of racial equality and justice, even though he might not get there with his followers. For all of our fellow citizens, and people who love peace all over the world. And that is that Martin Luther King was shot and was killed tonight. Tragically, Martin Luther King Jr. was assassinated on April 4, 1968, in Memphis, Tennessee, where he had gone to support striking sanitation workers. His death sparked outrage and mourning across the nation. In honor of his contributions, Martin Luther King Jr. Day was established as a federal holiday in 1986. King's legacy endures as a symbol of courage, justice, and the ongoing struggle for civil rights. His words and actions continue to inspire movements advocating for equality and justice around the world. King's legacy endures as a symbol of courage, justice, and the ongoing struggle for civil rights. Thank you for being a part of this journey. Don't forget to subscribe. Also, please leave a comment for more interesting content and let me know if you have any stories or questions.